lovelies! So I'm here today with uh, my haul video for Lush because it was just Christmas and then as you probably know if you saw my video last year they have the Boxing Day sale which is like 50% off a bunch of the items um, which is always scary but I'll get into that in a moment. Um, so let's go to a haul. So I got one box that no longer has its paper. It had like pretty wrapping paper but I don't know where it went. So uh, this one was from my friend John from uh, my other channel Metal Ass Gaming and everything else I got was in the sale. So I just wanted to go through and do that. I actually recorded this video the other day but it was like really really crap and I just I, I didn't like it so I'm redoing it. Um, I'm sorry if I'm a bit like Ugh, but I, I actually have a cracked rib at the minute so everything's really difficult. I had to get my boyfriend to help me like set up all the lights because usually I set up all my own equipment and you know go ahead and do it myself but um, at the minute kind of everything hurts so I had to get him to help me because I've cracked my rib and it's not much fun so well um, yeah but I'm just gonna get started then with the one I got for Christmas since it's the first one I got I suppose so um, I'm not sure what the name of this box was unfortunately but it had like green holly wrapping on it and I know what's most of what's in it so um, I can go through that anyway so let me see so the first thing that's in here is the Cinder's Bath Bomb, which I really, really love. It's like, I think it's meant to be like Christmas punch scent or something. It really d just does smell like Christmas. It's amazing. Um, the only problem I really have with this is it's like, it's way too small, I think. Like they could really, this could be, hmm, this could do with being um, like the size of Big Blue or whatever it's called or something, because it's just, it's really teeny and I don't feel like there's enough of it. But um, other than that, like it smells really, really good. So I love these. I got a bottle of the Hot Toddy Shower Gel, which is Christmas Spiced. Um, I can never really smell the shower gels until I use them. Especially because I've got this whole box of other smells, but it does, it, from what I can tell, it seems to smell similar to cinders, but that might just be because I have cinders in my nostrils now. But it's red and it's like really, really, really glittery, which is fun. Um, as is a lot of stuff I have. There's just gonna be glitter all over my house, which I'm fine with. My boyfriend, not so much. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I'm excited to try that and figure out how it actually smells. I got this bath bomb, and I wasn't sure what this was at first. Um, it's actually the Lord of Misrule, I believe, which I'm excited to try because everyone like goes nuts about this and I've never ever tried it before, so really fun to see. I can't even really tell what that smells like. I don't have the little card for this box of stuff. Um, because it, it was taken off the box so I wouldn't know what was in my present and I don't know where it went so I don't actually have any descriptions but it smells nice, <laughs> I know that much. So there are two soaps in this set I know which what one of them is, I don't know the other one is, but hold on me. Yeah, this one is Karma um, and it's all covered in glitter from other things in the box but this is the Karma soap which is great because I really 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 <laughs> I can't speak, I'm sorry. I really love the smell of Karma because I have it in like the solid perfume stick and I love it so much. It just smells amazing to me. I think I spoke about it in a previous Lush haul. I don't know what this is. It smells like maybe kind of coconutty or something. I'm not really sure. If anyone knows what this is, feel free to tell me, but it smells quite nice, so. Uh, what else have I not shown you from this box? I got a massage bar and again I don't know the name of this one, I'm sorry guys. I know the name of everything else I've got but for this box I'm a bit lost. Um, but yeah, so I got a massage bar and it feels like it'll be like really really good, especially because my back really hurts at the minute so I'm probably going to get my boyfriend to help me with this because it smells good. And it feels like these like lumpy bits would be like really really good for massaging so I'm excited to try this. And the last thing in here is this bubble bar. And I forget the name of this because I actually found it when I was in the shop for the sale. But it has like holly and stuff on it and it is really, really glittery. It's the same sort of lev level of glitter as uh, Starlight Starbright, you know, the melt. But again, it just it smells like Christmas. <laughs> I can't really give you a more, you know, definite answer than Christmas is what it smells like. But um, that's quite handy because I've actually ran out of all my bubble bars recently. So, oh my god, glitter. Oh, yep. That was a mistake. <laughs> well, um, okay, moving on to the individual things I got in the sale. So, I actually got the charm lipstick as well, but then I kind of got home and realized I didn't really want it, so I'm gonna see if I can take it back. Um, I haven't used it or anything, but I just asked kind of like, do you want light colors never really work on me? So why did I, it was just in the heat of the moment grabbing everything, but um, I might see if I can take it back, so I kind of don't really want it. But um, everything else I got is in here, so. Most of this was in the sale, as in like it was discounted and some of it wasn't, so I'll start with the stuff that wasn't discounted, bear with me. 
Um, I'm trying not too much to ramble in this. I'm sorry, so much glitter. I'm trying so hard, um, trying hard not to ramble so much in this video because I tend to do that. But I do have a story for this. So this is the Daddyo uh, shampoo. Now this is actually like a silver shampoo for people with blonde hair to tone out the brassiness. But the reason I got it was because I was in the gym a while back and. Um, it was, you know, after a swim and I was kind of like, you know, I was in there and then another girl came in and she, like, you know, she started using the shower and as you do, you just keep to yourself. But then she started shampooing her hair. <laughs> I just kind of smelled it and I was like, what you got there? <laughs> but um, I kind of just turned around and tried to, in the least creepy possible way, start to ask her about what this was because it smells exactly like Parma Violets. Like, I just got this really strong smell of Parma Violets, which is, like, one of my favourite smells. And I was like, oh my god. I need what you have, and I saw the Lush bottle, so I was like, right, okay, I'm fine out what that is. So we ended up having this whole big conversation about Lush and their products and this, and she let me actually use some of her shampoo to try, so I had to get just like a little bottle of this, just because I really love the smell. Oh, I wish they'd do like more things with this smell. The other thing I got was actually mostly for my boyfriend, but I love how it smells, so I might try to find a use for it, but it's the Defluff uh, shaving soap. And it's like, it's kind of like a mousse, and it smells so good. It smells kind of like the Strawberry Fields massage bar. It's like really like, kind of like strawberry chocolate and it's so nice. So, let's uh, start on the bottles that are in here. So I got two little bottles of things. I got one bottle of the So White shower gel to try. I believe it's apple, yeah, apple and rose, which sounded like a really not nice combination. Just try to smell it from this. I can't really smell the rose in it, but then again, as I say, I can't, I tend not to be able to smell things from these bottles until I use them. But um, it just smells like really clean and nice and fresh, so I'm excited to use that. And I don't know what this is. This is another thing I bought in the heat of the moment, but I'm actually kind of glad about this one. So it's um, the First Snow Sparkling Dusting Powder. It doesn't really say what it's for, it just says a citrusy powder to leave the skin looking as if it's been kissed by twinkling snowflakes. And it smells really, really good, so you just kind of like... Well, this is how I do it. I don't really know how it's meant to be done. But um, just do that and kind of rub it in. And immediately I get this like really really strong lovely smell and it just leaves you, you probably can't see it on the camera, but it just leaves you with the teeny tiniest little shimmer. It's lovely. So I was actually quite glad I got that because I didn't know what it was. I was like, that's 50% off. I'll grab that. So that's all the bottles. Everything else now is in little bags. And I honestly don't really remember what all I got, so let's find out. <laughs> Pop this down and I see if this is Oh my god, I'm covered in glitter and it's about to get worse because... <laughs> One of the things I got was another. Oh, it's kind of broken. Another thing I got was one, another Starlight Star Bright Bath Melt because I really, really like this one, and it's like it's really, really fruity. I think it's like very citrusy or something, but like lots of different ones. Like, I'm probably wrong, but it smells. To, oh my god! Every time I breathe on it, just glitter flies. I'm gonna put it back in. Um, to me, it smells like it's kind of like every type of citrus, like orange and lemon and lime. I don't know if that's what's in it, but that's what it smells like to me, and it is like. Can you see that? Like, it just ended up covered in this stuff and I can't... Oh, good God. But um, I was thinking of using all my really, really glittery stuff, like, on New Year's Eve to get ready. Although I still don't know where I'm going. I haven't decided if I'm even going anywhere. But on New Year's Eve, I feel like I should be sparkly. So I'm going to use all this stuff then. Uh, I think the rest is bath bombs. My favourite Lush thing is definitely bath bombs. Actually, I, I want to know how to make my own because I have some really good ideas, but... Let's see what I've got. So this is uh, So White. So I got the So White bath bomb as well as the shower gel. Yeah, it just, it smells really, really clean and nice and just really fresh. I'm really excited to try this again. It's very apple-y. I can't smell the rose from it still, but I can definitely smell the apple whenever I use the actual bath bomb. Um, next up is, yeah, I think this is the Lush Christmas Pudding or something it's called. Um, I don't even really know what it smells like to be honest. I kind of just got this because, again, it's one people talk about and it looked like it'd be a lot of fun colours and stuff. So I was like, oh, why not? And you know, it was in the sale, so I just kind of grabbed it as I was passing by. Um, so it'll be interesting to use this and see what I think of it. I'm not smelling anything wildly exciting. It smells just kind of like, almost like burnt sugar. Not burnt sugar, but like, you know, about to burn sugar, if you know what I mean. So like very sweet, so hopefully that'll be nice. And the last little single thing I got was another Cinder's bath bomb just because I do really love them. As I said, I don't think they're big enough, so I wanted to stock up on a couple. So that was the box from my friend and all the individual items. And I was something really big that was actually a complete whim. I went in looking for gift boxes and I felt like the ones they had this year were a bit crap. They didn't really have anything. Like last year they had some amazing ones that I loved. This year I felt like they were a bit lacking. 
I was kind of going in, I went on the website to see what kind of stuff I wanted before I headed in. Um, and I, like I, the one I really, really wanted was the Think Pink box, but they didn't seem to have it. I don't know if they've ever had it in the Belfast store, but that's kind of what I went in with in my head. But they didn't have that, and I, I was determined to come away with a box, so I looked down and saw this and just grabbed it as I was going by. Bought it on a complete fucking like random note, but here it is. It's the 12 days of Christmas. As it turns out, this is one like loads of people wanted. But the problem is, if you try to do the sale online, yeah, you save standing in the queues and like all the craziness, but everything sells out way too quickly. But if you go in the store, you're way more likely to get something. So I got this from my trip to the store. Um, I had the wee label, but I think I, oh no, maybe I do need the label. Hold on. Let's see. So the first thing I have, I believe this is a bath, <laughs> more glitter, gold glitter this time. This is a bath melt called Snow Angel. And I don't really know what this smells like. It smells weirdly familiar, but I cannot for the life of me place it. But um, it's a bath melt, and obviously it's really, really glittery, and apparently it leaves kind of like a blanket of snow, you know, across the top of the bath, so that'll be fun to try. Oh, good God. <laughs> um, next up is another Starlight Star Bright bath melt, so plenty of glitter here. <laughs> Even more glitter, we have got another one of these Holly Bubble Bars. Again, super, super shiny. And help. Um, next up I've got the Olive Branch Shower Gel, which actually smells nicer than I expected it to. I thought it was going to smell a bit sort of like too olive oil-ish, um, but it's actually really nice smelling and I use olive oil on my skin anyway because it's really good for it, so it's nice to have some soap with it in. You can see it actually does have the oil in as well because it's really cold in here and you can see where it's all kind of at the top there. <laughs> Uh, next up is the, ooh, that made a squeaky noise, uh, the Celebrate Body Lotion. So this is a body lotion with oranges, almond oil and lime and a splash of something or other to get you in the festive mood. Um, yeah, so it's body lotion. And I actually, yeah, I can smell like the sort of citrusy smells. I find like with a lot of the lotions they just kind of smell like Play-Doh, but this one I can smell like the smell it's meant to smell of from Smell, 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 Smell. Um, so that's nice. There's another hot toddy shower gel, so hopefully I'll like this. All the glitter's like crazy at the bottom of this one. Um, but yeah, so let me tr try smell this again. Yeah, that does smell really nice, so hopefully that'll be good because I've got two bottles of it now. Oh, I believe this is called Golden Wonder. <laughs> oh my god, you should see my legs, I'm just covered in glitter. This is a Golden Wonder bath bomb and that smells, again, it's a really nice smell, but not one I could really place for you, but again, it's nice and shimmery, so I'm excited to use that one. Got another Cinders bath bomb, so it's always good to have more of those since they're Christmas only, so once I've used them all up, they'll be gone. Another Lord of Misrule, again. Got another Karma soap, which again, I'm happy about because Karma smells amazing. No, I can't quite remember what this is called. It's something Santa, maybe like Dashing Santa or something. But it's uh, Dashing Santa, that sounds familiar. Well, it's a, it's a bath bomb anyway, and he's meant to like fly around your tub, so. That smells lovely. It's like quite a soft smell, that one. And the last one, I'm pretty sure this is Honey, I Washed the Kids soap. So I did manage to remember everything that was in here. I'm quite proud of myself. Um, this is a very, like, very subtle smell. I can imagine it'll probably smell like, more like honey when I don't have, like, all this other stuff up my nostrils, but it smells nice anyway. So, yeah, that is everything I got from Lush. I really love the box that the 12 Days of Christmas came in. It's like a big book. I kind of want to paint it as something else and use it for my room. Ow. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this haul. Um, have you ever went to any of the Lush sales? Like, I took, like, quick little sort of vlogs of the line and stuff, but not a huge amount. But yeah, if you've ever been there for Lush sales, uh, let me know in a comment, or if you think you would go to one, let me know, or if you even have a Lush in your city. A lot of people seem to think that you, like they don't have them in America, but I know for a fact they do, so you should check and see if there's one near you. 
Um, but yeah, so that is my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to stay to the end for some links, and there's also a whole bunch of links in the description box below, which you should always check, otherwise I'll cry. Um, you should also, also follow me on Instagram if you don't already, because I post, like, if I'm going to be doing something, like, it'll probably be the first place I'll post about it, and it has, like, the best sort of up-to-date updates, basically. So you should follow me on Instagram, but yeah. So that's all the links and stuff. Um, I'll see you in my next video. I've got a whole bunch of hauls and stuff. The sendings went on way too long. Bye, guys.